Well, uh, thank you so much for helping my project. Uh, could you say a couple of words about yourself? Hi, I'm Olya. Um, I like ducks. I like going out. I can make some drinks. That's awesome. Yeah. Um, well, did you know that NASA's planning to send astronauts back to the moon? They haven't done it in a while, so they probably should. Uh, so you think it's a good idea? I mean, I feel like they haven't fully explored it. So, like, if they go back, do they have rovers on it, right? Uh, they've been trying to put some probes on it, but... Um, like rovers? Uh, not on the moon yet, but they're, okay. they're, they plan to land some, for sure. Yeah. They have rovers on Mars. What are they looking for? Um, well, maybe there's like uh, water, ice, frozen, like these permanently shadowed craters so like near the poles. Yeah. Um, I feel like if they can't get on Mars, they should go back to the moon. They're oh, looking really? for that, right? You know? Yeah, I mean, Mars is a lot farther away, so. It is, though. I don't think they stood on Mars yet. No, no. Uh, humans have only been to the moon. Uh, whenever you think about the future of humanity, like 200 years out, do you think we're still only on the Earth? Or do you think we've like actually expanded? Some people have definitely made it to space at that point. Yeah. And you think they're sitting at a Starbucks in space? It's probably not going to be called Starbucks. Probably will have some other, like some other spatial menu. I have no idea. But it's probably going to be people with more like money to afford it. So the rest of us will be chilling. Oh, down here? Yeah. Uh, do you think uh, maybe the price to get down low enough so eventually just everyday people can go? In 200 years, maybe. Maybe they'll start to. Mm -hmm. So I don't know about like... Like maybe in 150, a couple will be able to go we'll have that kind of money, and then it'll be like, okay, upper middle class will work it down. Like maybe I'm not sure what the benefits of that will be though over staying here. Mm -hmm. The atmosphere will have been affected. Or maybe we can do just like exploration or being someplace different. Maybe it'll be a different. I mean, being able to jump like and float in the air is kind of fun. That could be fun. Like trampoline everywhere. Oh wow. <laughs> Then you have to come down here for a non trampoline. Yeah, place. you're gonna forget. You're gonna try and jump in the street. Like, man, that's so weird. Yeah, for <laughs> um, If you could, would you take a trip to space? Me personally, I don't like planes, so I probably oh, okay. wouldn't. I mean, I could do zero gravity in a plane, maybe. But a spaceship would be a little like I feel like I wouldn't think it was real. I think I'd be like, those are the stars. You're telling me that's a planet? Yeah. Okay. Um, is it the height or just like the air travel itself? Like, would you be comfortable in a balloon or? I feel like it would be both. I'm just, I'm not, I'm afraid of heights. Okay. So I think that both of them would be a little like unnerving. Like a plane, it's like the turbulence. With a balloon, it's like, you don't know what you're going to get on it. So I feel like it would be like, oh, I'm in space now. Now there's just no gravity. And I mean, like hot air balloons with a basket, I'm just like, uh, just I've seen up. so many baskets that are broken. I'm just like, yeah, that stuff be in my that happened there. The time. I mean, you see Apollo missions and stuff, and mm -hmm. like everything else. We have better technology. I don't keep up personally with how many times they're still doing the space stuff. Like, I think last I heard it was like SpaceX or something, but I don't know about NASA's stuff and what they're doing. Stars, they're still looking for those. Atlantis. Absolutely. Uh, Oh, oh yeah, um, I see this as a time capsule for generations, 200 years to look back on this time. Anything you think would be worth them knowing about? Um, hmm. Make the world a better place even if it's not currently. I like it. Well, thank you so much. Thank you.